the Fallout 3 guides, and uh, today I'll be showing you my Fallout 3 props that I've either made or gotten one way or another. Um, I'm going to start out with my videos again, some Fallout 3 videos uh, for uh, New Vegas and such. So, uh, okay, let's start. Um, here's a giant Nuka Cola bottle. As you can see, it's, um, it's like the one in Sierra Petronova's uh, Nuka Cola Museum in the corner, which I've always wanted a huge one. It's the model of that, pretty much. Um, down here, we got the Volt Boy Bobblehead. Right here, we got a regular Nuka Cola. Just the regular one. And a 355 um Mexican Coke bottles is what I like to make them in. My favorite that I made, the Fusion. If you want me to make, um, tell you how to make these, I will. Um, that's my favorite one. Uh, that one's in Fallout 1, I believe. Nuka Cola Cherry from Fallout 2. Oh, uh, we'll take lunchbox. I got some Radex here. It's not that good, but, uh, I didn't really try too hard on it. I just wanted to be different than everything else I had. That kind of thing. I got some Mentats back there. Um, this is my best prop, I think. Because it was also the easiest. Some buff out. It's in the actual canister, like, in the game. Stuff. Over here. We have my Nuka Cola Quantum. And, um, it looks green on the screen, but trust me, it's not. Um, in the back, it's kind of the label's a little bit messed up, which I don't really like, but I mean, it's okay, it's not the front, you know. So, um, let me turn off the lights and you guys can see it. One second. So, it looks green, I don't know why. Well, it's kind of glowing. It looks like a yellow. So, uh, Thanks for watching. Uh, if you want me to do a tutorial on the quantum too, I will. Um, thanks for watching, and uh, have a great day, guys. And uh, remember, I'll be making more videos. So see you later.